Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Aziza. I'm reading today for the sign of Gemini for love and relationship for the month of November. And this is the second reading for the second week of November 2023. Confusion. Always Gemini is confused or reading between lines a lot. Uh huh. Okay, dear Gemini, uh, you are confused about too many things with your partner. Oh my God. Um, you underestimate yourself. You underestimate your gift. You underestimate like your financial security too. You underestimate yourself as you are really very dear to your person, very dear to them so much. They love you so much and care for you a lot. A lot of you, like, you know, could be married also. The marriage person of you that you want divorce, you want separation, you don't trust your person, you are fed up with them, the way they are, the way they behave. You feel like, you know, maybe they are not really not really matching your mentality or the rules you put or set for your person also. Um, I didn't say your person is not smart. Of course they are. They are intelligent and smart, but maybe not exactly what you want. Um, you are confused why you are lucky sometimes and sometimes you are not. You are confused why things are not really changing in your life, why you have to deal with the situation the way it is, handle finances, bills, money, everything. And you feel the other person hasn't really gone or done anything from their part to meet you halfway at least. Um, your person like to feel that they are declined by you, not just because of finances. They know that they disappoint you financially. They appreciate you very much though, but they feel like you know, that they are being declined as a person to you. You make them feel bad, even if you don't mean it. Um, you make them feel like you know, that they are not really intelligent or smart enough. Because you tell them, don't do it my way. Don't do it this way. And you snap at them. Even the other person is really polite with you. You yell, you scream. You, maybe some of you call names too. It gives them the indication you're going to really walk away from them. And it makes them feel the insecurity deep inside them. Like you know, that, uh, what did I do? I'm, I'm just like that. You know, I cannot help it. I try. Um, some of them, they don't talk. They keep quiet, but they don't like it. They feel like, no, maybe you are bored with them. Nothing that they can offer you and do it and you are happy with. They don't say that to you, but they keep it to themselves. They feel like you know, that they are trying harder to please you, to make you happy. And you are like, I'm looking into myself. This person cannot commit in any way. They are not going to do it. You are iffy about it. Of course, Gemini. Not satisfied with anything. <laughs> but yet, you are upset. You want to isolate this person, but you are not doing it. You want to continue with them, then you say, I'm going to continue with them upon what? I'm the one who's making everything. Why should I continue with this person? 
you don't know what to do. Like the situation is not changing and you are really sick and tired of it. You are bored with it. You don't know what to do. A lot of you, a lot of you wants to divorce, but you are not divorcing. And you feel like you know, that I know this person is really a good person. I don't know if it's really like you know, the right timing to do it. If it's really right even to do it and walk away. You want to change. You want a solution. You feel like you know, that sometimes you want to walk away and disappear. You don't want to tell this person where am I. Even from family members. People like you know, who always rely on you all the time. You are tired of it. You don't know what to do exactly. You are always suspicious also about the loyalty of your partner or your person. Even though that they are sitting around in front of you, they are not doing anything. Your person feel lucky with you, happy. They appreciate everything you do for the home, for them too. They love you so much. They care for you a lot. It's like they worship the, the ground that you walk on. But you are like, you, 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 I don't like it. I cannot really do this anymore. I don't know why I'm really being in a relationship that I have to do everything for the other person to be with me. What am I getting from this? Why you, I'm staying in this marriage? Why I'm staying in this relationship? Not all of you are married here, but you feel like in that, uh -huh, I don't know. Besides like you know, an issue of trust, are you Gemini making excuses? just to find like you know, a fault of your person or any fault for you to be really with someone else. Gotcha. Or to just have a blast with something. A lot of you are tired like you know, financially, I know that. Um, you, you do a lot and you did a lot. You want that excitement with someone, excitement with someone that every time like you know that even if you want to be really hooking up with someone, it doesn't go very well the way you ex expected. It's making you really tired, it's making you unhappy. You feel like you know that if I want really to lose this person I'm committed to, I might really not really find somebody to really give me commitment. It's not true, you will, but Perhaps it's not the right timing. Let's put it this way. Whoever you are married, I see you that you know you end up like really divorcing this person or walking away from them. Not all of you. Because it feels here that it's not the right timing for you to leave. And a lot of you are going to continue with their marriages. You will continue with your marriage. But your person is leaving you alone like to do things on your own. Perhaps you need a vacation, you need like you know, really something different and you feel like you know, sometimes money situation cannot really allow me to go on vacation right now. The other person is not listening. They like you know, really um, a give or a giver like you know, to their family, other people, not me. What am I supposed to do? There are like you know, Geminis different than other Geminis here because I see many stories in the front of me, not only one. So in a private reading is something it's really better to ask about a certain person because it will be different from a Gemini to another one, okay? Let's see. Yeah, the other person is holding on you so much. They are committed themselves to you. He or she wants you. They believe sometimes they have been really selfish with you. They admit that. But they can be really lazy. You are more energetic more committed to your work, business, you know the responsibility, you know and understand the value of money, how to spend your money. The other person, like, you know, they spend it, but they don't know how to spend it. That's the problem. You know better. You work so hard, really very much. You do work very hard. In general, you are a happy person with good energy, radiant energy, attract people to you all the time. You want really to add that excitement. And it says here, something or someone is gonna make you happy and come around, like, you know, there is a different love here, you know. I'm getting there is a different love. 
um, the person like no really uh, in your life they want to stop you from being around someone else they don't want you to walk away even if you are really not happy with the spouse who have been really not really with you and you push them away they are trying to come back to you yeah you might really separate it from someone that you are married to or in commitment and they want you back they will they are trying to come back to you renew the relationship that you f they feel like you know, that you are leaving too soon too quick or that's not really even right like you know that they believe that that you should not really done so they don't believe that they did anything wrong to you which is they did past mistakes long time ago but they are not doing it anymore they do understand how much you are hurting by them they are hurt right now like you know, by you also and they want to see like you know if they have another chance or a better chance with you as a new beginning to come back to each other even if you take your time with them they don't want you to go another person i get here like in your relationship maybe this is a new relationship that it hasn't been um you cannot forgive the spouse that's what i got first another person that you have been dealt with like you no know, sense to be that it did not go really like you no know, much or very well it could be a new relationship this person like you know, approach you and you have a lot of really beautiful love around you and but you find like you know, that you moved so fast so quick with each other and suddenly they dropped it and you are like what what happened they are not ready it could be like you know, that they need really like you know, some more time a lot of them like you know, they build like you know or stick in your mind so much as they want really that actual commitment and they wear into it so much and you feel like you know oh i'm confused uh, what happened here they wanted me so bad they wanted me to divorce the husband or the wife and be with them or to walk away from another person and be with them they walked away from another person so what happened now so what's the problem why all of this happen they they feel like you know, that they have maybe the responsibility that's what they told you um they want to work on their money situation yes it's true but in the matter of fact this person did not trust you enough for them to continue with you that's what's going on they assume always that they, you are going to cheat on them you are going to be with someone else they are attracted to you so much so badly they are so much in love with you and that happens so fast but they think that they are rushing into it they rushed into that commitment and they feel like they need really a break or to pull on the side little bit because they don't trust you you did not do anything bad you never did anything to cheat on them but they feel threatened by you that you might cheat on them and walk away and it's not going to work so they have to hide and take a break and separate from you right now they felt they cannot commit no matter what they tried their jealousy is crazy and they want to return to you but they want to deal with you on the side you know on and off and you are like no it's not going to happen i'm not going to deal with you that way because i want to be the only one i don't want to be second they might really know somebody like you know, that they are really going to them but they feel like you know, that you are capable of cheating on them whether you like it or not you were happy doing an effort like you no know, and really ongoing this person wants you to be with them if he is a male like you no know, he want to be your husband if she want to be your wife yes he did a lot of effort around this person but they feel like you no know, wait a minute sometimes you are gemini being called to him or her they cannot stand it really very much and they don't understand it they feel like you no know, perhaps it's not the right timing or the timing is not ripe yet for them to continue 
they don't want to get it anywhere between you two right now because you are under their test. They want to test the situation and to see if they can trust you by time. We'll see what's going to happen. It sounds to be here that you are taking a break from each other. They still want to deal with you, but you don't want to because you don't trust like you know, to be them, like you know, sleeping with someone else and sleeping with you and all of that. Anyway. I don't see you discontinue, really, but you're going to really go slow with this. Best of luck for you, dear Geminis. I hope you enjoy the reading. And if you need a private reading, please contact me. And the link for my website is below this video, mysticalaziza.com. After you click on reading prices, please purchase your reading, then give me a call. And the phone number is listed on my website. And thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.